Yummy breakfast, but the knees. I hate those signs. Yeah. I used to, first of all, I would have to do it and I'm left handed. <laughs> so I would write, and as I would write, <laughs> I'd just smear and everything. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> this kind of sums up womanhood and manhood, I think. So, See how you are with this smart guy. Oh, okay. Hit me. <laughs> Hit him. Right. Uh, word of the crew starting three letters with D. Yeah. Wait, let me see here. 34 yeah. across. Wait, wait, don't get too excited. No, but see, that's the way I do a puzzle. I put in a word, and then when I see a, a letter, no, uh, that's one. Could be that's problems. one now. Yeah, let them just think, think about let it grow like a stain. I don't know if I can say this out loud. <laughs> it's the, it's the uh, hoar, hoar frost. <laughs> More frost? Yeah. H O A R. Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> I got excited. <laughs> I hate it when doctors. Have you ever heard a doctor say that? Could be anything? No. I knew My that. knee hit. Is it a brain tumor? No. So nothing. It could be anything. You could be leaking oil. Okay, that's relapses, making this simile, making that renames. He's a numero. He's a numero. We could have used him yesterday. <laughs> I'm Rich Woodrow. Do you Donna, you a father knows best. That's hmm. way before your time. Hmm. Yeah. It was one of the kids. My father didn't wear jacket. It must have been an alteration <laughs> of the show. Now you made me feel like a fool. I pulled over and I can't answer any of your questions. Got it. Thank you. You just missed some good television there, pal. <laughs> All right, anyway. <laughs> Neutron walks into a bar and orders a drink. And bartender brings it and Neutron says, how much? And bartender says, for you, no charge. <laughs> that I like. All right, good. Thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Staying on science jokes. <laughs> Coffin platform. Is it B-I-E-R, beer? B-I-E-R. Did I say B-I-E-R? Yeah. Yeah, I'm agreeing with you. No, you weren't. You said the same thing. The answer would, would, but you would have been yes. <laughs> 26 down. <laughs> all right, everybody be cool, all right? <laughs> Insert between. How many letters? No, I thought she was telling me the answer. A lot. <laughs> the first one enough? No. Okay. I-N. Interject. Sign this. I don't. I, mm. I n t e r j e c t. Oh, in, wait. In, I n t e r j e c t s. Now. E d. Interjected. All the phone. Is it? Is it last tense? No, it's it's present tense. I n. Wait. So we got get some more. See if enter. Can we? Does enter? All right, hold on a second. Help. 32, 36 across. Oh, we're back to stiff bristles. S-E. S-E-T-A-E. -E. That's right. Mm -hmm. Did you see anybody questioning it? <laughs> no, when you start going no, off the page, married. then there might be some problem there. 41 across. <laughs> oh, here we go. Where's Rossi? This is a color, I guess. C E R I S E, cerise, cerise, yeah, really and cerise. crimson. Yeah. Reds. Reds, I guess, 41. I mean, yes. Okay. I didn't. The good movie. Flew of a type of color. Into something. Oh, road. What's 27 down? 27. Tour employee. Which Guide. employee? Not G U I D, no. Road? Road warrior. <laughs> A tour employee? Yeah, and he's a road something. Road scholar. Wait, no. Road scholar. Yeah, they actually That's probably where they all end up. 
That would be one that they would probably, if they had a question mark on the end, uh, it All right, what's 20, 28 down? A tour employee hits road oh, down. Here we go. They from cut the, costs. They yeah, from your road, 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 road guy, scholar From your stitch and bitch thing here. <laughs> well, let's say uh, seamstresses, dressmakers. D-R-E-S-S-M-A-K-E-S. -S 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 -E yeah. I went to one session, all right? <laughs> Just use duct tape to bend the, to the seams. Yeah, Have you ever actually gone to something like that? No. That's well. I mean, about thirty it, seconds in, you probably shoot tailor? yourself. Would it be the same thing as a tailor? No, no, no because it's line, <laughs> male and female. They wouldn't be wondering how the Red Sox made out. I don't think that'd be in the conversation. Forty-six across. You, you guys are talking about different things. He thinks you're asking him if he's been to a seamstress. Yeah, the, the, the stitch of the girl thing. Oh, where they, okay. Do you make that up or is that real? Can I tell you a joke really? No, that's real. Go ahead. Okay. This guy walks into a uh, suit shop. He sees a nice suit he likes. It's on sale. It's price, price is right. And uh, nice cut, nice material. So uh, he says, all right, I try it on. And I got I to gotta make a couple adjustments. The guy says, all right, I'll tailor it up for you. Handle it. No problem. Pick it up tomorrow. So he just measures it up. He goes to pick up the suit. And he says, there's a bump, there's a, like a bump right here. He says, oh, just like, put your shoulder forward and then you go away, right? I forget the punchline. He says, one leg looks longer than the other. He says, like that. well, put your leg out and walk like that and it'll be fine. He says, okay. He walks outside, he's walking down the street, and he's walking like this, so the suit looks straight. So he says, hey, where'd you get your suit? He says, I got it right over there. He says, man, I got to go there. If they could fit a handicap like you, they could fit anybody. <laughs> That's like in ancient Greece when the guy walks into the tailor shop with his toga. He hands it to the tailor. The tailor holds it up and says, Euripides? And the guy says, Yeah, Eumenides. Oh, God. 51 across. Moving right along. Oh, let's see. That would be. Ardent impulses. Ah, we got it. Desires. All right. Maury Amsterdam. Yeah. When you need him. <laughs> Maury Amsterdam, my God. Yeah, who's got a cello? Come on. 50 across. Shriver or Darba? Pam. There's too much stuff tied up. Yeah. Remember that Pam Darba, she was in the show with the girl who was in it with her got killed by a stalker. Do you remember that? She was like 24 years old. I think it was her younger sister or something. And you're still free. <laughs> You don't know the half of it, son. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can see. Yeah. M.A. We might be able to break this sucker open here. 54. Oh, three match connection. Three on a match. Three on a match. Soldiers. 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 Yeah, but it's it's oh. not a... Um, well, we'll let us do that so far. All I've got is blank, is blank A. Oh, on A. You just said it. Three on a match. TMA. But that, well, three on a match is would be T O A M. That's three on a. But that it's not. No, 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 no. What is? It? What's the clue? Connection. Connection. Fifty-four. Oh, I see. Oh, wait yeah. a minute. Three, three, match, three, match. three so match connection. That's what I thought it was. O N A. That's the. Oh, the connection. Oh, I always miss that. <laughs> anyway, what's forty-six across? Alright. Rent sign abbreviation. So we still got five minutes. So. Close by? Yeah. Uh, Avail? It's in a book. 46. Wait, what is it? Rent dash sign. Rent sign abbreviation. Yes. Ed? Blank Ed? blank S. Ed? I forgot the question already. Yes. Rent RMS. sign abbreviation. RMS rooms? No. Rooms. Yeah, rooms for rent, yeah. Vacancy, VAC? Let's see, road, man, what, what's this, 27 down? That? that was the tour guide? Yeah. Roadmaster? We got ONA, road, man. Let's try 57, that should road break manager. it. You know, like a rock and roll band would have. Anti-aircraft fire, ack, ack. Now it makes even more sense. Yeah, so you might as well just finish it up. G-E-R. <laughs> Leaving that little bit later. I don't know what I'd do without you, Kev. 
<laughs> All right. Keep a lid on it. <laughs> 62 across. Mammal's coat. Begin. Help. Help. Uh, GE. Oh, boy. Well, it's not plumage. plumage. No. Plumage. <laughs> yeah, those feathered mammals. I'll tell you, those feathered elephants. What's 57 down? Hold it. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Oh, a bee. He was amazing, Ali. A bee, is that an Indian name? <laughs> 63. Yeah, it's a Pooh's brother. Yeah. Farmer Queen of Spain, three letters. Imelda. <laughs> okay. No, no, that's the Philippines. Yeah. <laughs> Spain. What's her name? I'm looking at 16 across. What is that? Mil Teresa. Teresa. I'm thinking, is it a generic term or is it, does the, the ex queen yeah, have yeah, a. She, only her close friends called her that. That's why three letters. Uh -huh. So I didn't know. What's 65 across? And this is hyphenated. Go between. Middleman. Begins with a U. Yupper. Oh. Williamson used to. In the army, they have this thing. Umpire, it's abbreviations umpire. for thing. Ooh, it doesn't fit though. It's ER. For yes, sir, they say yupper. Mm. I think umpire's right. I think you're in trouble there. No, these are all right. Go between. Nah. Uh, well, let's go back to interpocket. Interlocutor, interpocketer, interpoke. Interlocutor? Is that what you're looking for? No, but it's, no, no I'm <laughs> not looking for that. Insert between. Oh. Inter, <laughs> interpoker? Interpoker. <laughs> Interrupt. But, oh, ACAC, uh, well, wait, 57, let me make sure this is right. Wait, that doesn't look right at all. Anti-aircraft fire. Oh, A-K-A-K. -K. ACAC. Yeah. That is right. Well, thank you, okay. honey. Durka, durka. <laughs> That's what they were called. Or in Swedish, gadooga doo What's 67 across? Spuds. What's Tater. Taters. Uh, Taters. Ooh. Yeah, so yeah so what's an Irish seven course meal? Ooh. How can it be? Six pack and a potato. Six pack and a spud, yeah. T. T. A. T. A. Wait a minute, there's something wrong with the bee. Yeah, something's wrong. Float like a butterfly, sting. A sting. Oh, but that cack works. S T I N G S T I N G. Float, yeah, wait. Wait. Float like a butterfly doesn't have anything connected yeah. to sting like a bee. Yeah, that's Muhammad no, Ali. He said yeah, dance no. like a butterfly, sting like a bee. No, no, he did no, say float. He did like say a float, like a float. Like a float. But that's what, not connected what floats to like a butterfly? A butterfly. Like a butterfly. A moth. Simile. Like a rat. It's a simile. It would hover. Isn't that what a, but a, a butterfly does? No, that's what a hummingbird does. That's true. Hmm. Flit. Flit. Good. Float like a butterfly, flip like a bee. No, no, no there's nothing about, saying. there's it's nothing not having to do with a bee in there. It has no nothing quote. to do with Casper Clay. They're yelling at you. Yeah. Uh, that's, like, that's not very nice. No, I, well, we're going to have to have nice people on there. We're moving my old know? quick right still work. <laughs> <laughs> it's about an eight inch, of, I've got them lined up. <laughs> um, so, but if Akak's right, it begins with A. All right, moving on, 58. Five and a half yards, it's, and it's hyphenated. Five hyphen a hyphen five and a half yards. Meter. At the stitching thing there, they probably would come up with that right away. Yeah, but is it like yards, like uh, area measurement of an area? How many letters? Flat area. Three. Concrete. Oh, oh, a, a rod, isn't it? That sounds good to me. I don't do, 58. Do I don't do much masonry. <laughs> That's the one in grammar you, school. You Nobody said, can remember. You don't do much measuring. I'd be worried. No, okay. no, <laughs> 59 down. <laughs> December 24th or 31st? Uh, Eve. Eve. Yeah, Eve. Eve. Oh. Am I feeling right? 60 down. Yeah. Adherent of Judaism. Well, it'd be Jew, but three, it's three letters, but uh, adherent of Judaism, but you're not supposed to use the same word with the same word. No, you can't. Well, actually, they would, Jew and Judaism are spelled differently. That's three. Right. Let's try and get one, get the first letter. What's 58 across? Jew? Is filled with pleasure. 
Yeah, that would be a joke. Between, <laughs> between. No, 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 they're two different clues. You can't cross yeah, the it's, clues. it's like a linking thing. Oh, never mind. Yeah. Mm. Let's get some of these. Yes. <laughs> D, 40, 48 down. Winter windshield treatment. D icer. 48. Yep. D icer. Fifty-two of them. Primitive See, weapons beginning with an S. Yeah, but I mean saber. The Weather Channel. Primitive. That, no, no, primitive right. like the spear. Hittites. Spear. 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 Okay. Rejoice. And now for the weather. It's raining. That was a Jimmy Bross. <laughs> you find in that. Rejoice says. Yeah. All right. Ah, it is. It looks like it's going to be Jew. We got, that's not right. They shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> Why? They're breaking their own rules. If we're in a crossword puzzle, do we not bleed? Trailing bramble. Nobody? Honestly. What crowd? Trailing bramble. <laughs> Trailing what? Bramble. bramble. Like, like I'm lost bushes, on bramble. Uh, uh, bushes out in the desert, bramble. Uh, that could be wrong. <laughs> 64 <laughs> across. Don't admit it. Jump, jump across. It's gonna be over something, right? What, what letters do you have? O V E. Looks like they're going for over a leap, but that doesn't sound like a real word to me. Instead of the bits. Sixty-one down is what? Globe. It's orb. Okay. Do what? Sixty-six also, across. Band. Trailing bramble. This is going to be a crossword puzzle word. That's an A. D A B A R R E. Whatever that means. B uh, Dubars. Dubari. What's 43 down to confirm it? Abjectly submissive. Serviles. B I L E. Okay. We'll get it through the back door. 56 down. Catch a glimpse of a spy. Donna Ray told me that. It's B A Y. Dewberry. There you go. A dewberry. That's what the thing says. Vipers is going to be this, right? 55 across. Vipers, that's what you use on the... Venomous old world snakes, vipers. Yeah, for your future. Okay. 35, 35, 35 down. <laughs> Vendor is seller and there's Yalta. We're cooking. Except we don't... What is that? Oh, sure we do. What's 63 down? Oh, former queen of Spain. Ends an A. Uh, Ava. Yeah. <laughs> Ava. One of the Gabor sisters. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. She <laughs> married the king and then... Uh, all right, we got it. What's 20? That's 26 down. Insert between. Inter... Interlock. Interconnect. Interpocket. Yeah. Intercede. It's probably a T. I-N-T-E-R. What is a cac? I say the stronger I love the... ac What is that? Um, Speak English. Uh, aircraft fire. Ack -ack, really? ack -ack guns, yeah. Interposing? Interconnect? Intercede? That's interrupt? Ack -ack, could ack, ack be C? A, C, A? No, but dressmaker works. To interrupt. I, I, N, T, F, T, O, S. That, that follows up, uh... Could it be AC, AC instead of AK? Well, what's but, but that would screw up dressmaker. Uh, what is 67 across? 67 across is, oh yeah, with taters. Yeah. I'll, I'll, so finish 62 that. 62 across. Yeah. T A T E R S. So it's an E down here. K. Inter. P O K. Interposes is what I can think of. That'd be another but. vowel. <clears throat> Because that's Try definitely 60, not a B. Try that's 62 across, wrong. Rich. Uh, we don't know that one, but that's ah, interposes okay. looks like she's... F-L-A-K. Flak. That's Flak. what you got. Yeah. Uh, Anti-aircraft uh, guard. L-A-K. All right, now it all Very falls good. together. Very good. All right. Uh, interlope. Interlope. No. Oh, an interloper, yeah. Okay. Interlope, right. Rich. Under the okay. uh, over. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, George, man. That was great. Uh, my <laughs> oh, no problem. Hi. <laughs> nice meeting you. Yeah. Thanks. Right. See you now. When's the next time you're on? Two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah. All right, I'll check you out. Take weeks. it easy. How do you start? 12 30. 12 30? All right.
What's 62 across? Mammals coat. The on the side of the truck. Oh, wait, let's get back to the inter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I N T E R P O L inter. O P? Interloper. Is that what you have? Interlope. Just loop. Interlope. It doesn't work. If Pam Darber is right, inter. It's P. May I? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Mm, not sure, but I'm getting wet. Maybe Pam's not right. <laughs> there, I don't know. No, 60, we should be able to get 60. For a go between. What is 60? 60, uh, wait a minute, 65. Wrong question. Hold the phone. Yeah, go between. I'm thinking of go between there's somebody stepping in between people, but go between, like go between buildings. I don't know. Is it, do you know this is right? Stay stays up. Wait a minute. I spelled it wrong. Hold the phone. Well, that happens. SDA stays. Wait a minute. Holy jeez. Doesn't stray an inch. Stays put. Oh, stays put. That's right. All right. Ooh, what the heck is that going to be? It says put so. If that's wrong, it's holding up the. Uh, uh, no, it's, it's, it's right. It's right. Oh, but this is wrong. So we're looking at the B. Oh, yeah, which isn't the 57 word. 57 down. What's 57 down? What are we putting there? Float like. Oh, we don't know what it is. But it oh, begins with an F. Flit. F L I T. Yeah. It's the only thing it can be. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Now you Yeah. I couldn't see it. He's hiding it from me. He's that way. I know. You are? <laughs> that helped a lot. Uh. Wow. All right, let's go through them again here. Let's see. 62 across is Mammal's Coat. Uniter? Goes between the Uniter. Can I see what Mammal's Coat looks like in the clues here? We're putting that, we're, we're running out of time. We're putting that in. <laughs> we're working, we'll work with that. that was into what? Into Plot? Into. What, what are the vowels? In, I and inter... 62 across. Oh. Inter, interpolate. Interpolate. I-N-T-E-R-P-O-L-A interpolate. Okay. Good enough. And the queen of... That's not right. It's good enough. <laughs> All right, now. Anna. People. Anna. Anna. Queen of Spain. All right, so what is 63 across now? Pelage. 62. It's pelage. A mammal's coat is a pelage. That's a new one on me. All right. The Pelagio. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pelage. Yeah, look that, look that up, Kev. All right, hey, Chip. A <laughs> mammal's coat is a pelage. Oh, we have five other words wrong, one or the other. <laughs> oh, well, let me see. <laughs> Maybe I can clear it up. Rejoice. Yeah, that's it. Uni what's 65 across? Go between. Wow, that's a stretch. A uniter? A uniter could be a go between. He might not be a go between, too. Well, that's, that's not, in common parlance, that's not what you'd call a uniter. Yeah, but you know, if it's a uniter, that means there's two separate sides and then there's a go between who brings them together. So that could make sense. Yes, it could. <laughs> or not. <laughs> That's right, or not. That's why I'm saying it's a real stretch to put that as, a, as the answer. No, I, All right, well, we got it anyway. Oh, Thank God we had a genius here. <laughs> besides ourselves. <laughs> besides you. Yeah, you were a little no, short I said today. Beside ourselves. Oh, okay. You're doing the genius. Okay, are we going to do this one now? I'll just erase it and we'll start again. No, I would. Okay. One a day is plenty. <laughs> <laughs> One a day today was more than plenty. I got some bad news for you guys. It's not the word. <laughs> oh, You're <man>. not done. <laughs> yeah, what, I, I knew it was. There's what, no word? What's the word? I, I bet flit is wrong. Uh, wrong. <laughs> flit, float, flat. Does not exist. <laughs> I didn't think so. Well, that's an old dictionary. Maybe it's a new oh, word. A oh, sure. That's a boss. I'll look it up on my phone. <laughs> there you go. All right. I can't look it up on my phone. Did you jump at that Anna is the Queen of Spain? I mean, it sounds good, but you lost his neck. <laughs> so that was a brossy answer. It works, so let's use it. <laughs> and you can spell it either way. <laughs> Better yet. Could be Eva, too. 
Could be. Eva Braun. Oh, no, but that was, that was Argentina. Yeah, it could be uh, Ina, I-N-A instead of Ina. Which gives us You say Ina, Ina, I say Ina. I say tomato. Tomato. P-I-L-A-G-E as far as coming. Teddy Kennedy used to actually P-I-A-A-A. say tomato. Tomato? Tomato instead of tomato. But what we come up with with a, uh, what don't we know? All right, try other le- other vowels for the mammal coat. How far did you get on the P? Uh, there you go. Yeah. What is it? P I L A G E. P I L A G E. Yeah. That's pillage. P E L P E. How many cracks you want at it? What What is it? P E L A G E. Okay. P E. The Queen Ina. E N A. Oh, Looks everybody nice knows her. Well, the king said enough, and that was it. <laughs> oh, we did it. We finished it twice. You find? <laughs> you look that up. That's a fair. Well, he's got a Seiko Sportsmatic thing. All right, we did it. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> Number four in the can. Number four in the can. <laughs> All right. What an exciting. That was quick. Uh, you make it look like you're exhausted from that. Come on. No, I'm exhausted from you. This is fine. Miss? <laughs> uh, we got it. Thank you. You just missed some good television. <laughs> Well, Rich completed the puzzle, but I still think there's a couple of mistakes in there. Part of the difference of opinion I have with him is his methodology of doing the puzzle. He wants to do one across, then two across, then three across, and like that. I think that's a little too rigid to really get the most out of it. My technique is to put down a word and then find a word that crosses it somewhere and then find a word that crosses that, and sort of the solution spread out like a stain across the crossword puzzle grid. Uh, I find that works a little faster, it's a little more stimulating for the brain, and when you do it one by one by one by one, you have all these loose ends left over, and by the time you get to the end, as he did, you may have a few wrong answers because you just were tired of it already. But outside of that, I'd say he did a pretty good job. Very simple puzzle, though. Really ought to go up to the New York Times. Okay? (laughs) Well, there was uh, quite a difference of opinion on the strategy to attack the crossword. And, um, you know, I thought there was going to be a fight a couple times, but everything seemed to work out in the end. Um, I don't don't know about... I I think we need to... uh, bring our guests down a little bit you know they're starting to make us look bad um i don't know how i feel about my only answer being uh, a way to violently kill somebody so i'm going to talk to my therapist about that other than that i'll be back in two weeks all right good. all right well, after today, I was thinking, I never thought I'd associate these two things, but Zen of crossword puzzles. It's the journey, not the destination. It's the fun of the interaction. And what I learned today is it, it's, it's better to have guys like us of IQs of between 87 and 92. You know, just writing down the answers, it's not as much fun. It's more fun looking through the dictionary, trying to figure it out, not getting the answer and ultimately not caring and having a cup of coffee. That's me for today, guys. Thanks.